Hi guys, um, I am waiting for my mom to come out to the car today. Um, we are going to go to um, Wholesale Supplies Plus, um, which is actually a handmade studio store. So that is in Ohio. And um, I live a, a decent distance from it, but close enough to go for the day and look around. I did a pre-order and um, I'm going to pick it up because you get 10% off if you pick up your order. So, and obviously no shipping charge. Um, so I made an order, they called and told me it's ready. I'm waiting for my mom to come out to my truck so we can leave and go. And the kids are ready. James, or Patrick, say hi. <laughs> so we are going to hopefully be able to film in wholesale supplies and I'm gonna try to to film a little for you guys but I'm so excited all right guys um, see you in a minute Everybody, it is Caitlin. I just got back from the handmade studios that's connected to wholesale supplies. It's their little store that they have in Ohio. Um, it was about an hour and a half drive for me to get there and an hour and a half back home. So three hours of driving today um, and I'm tired. 
don't mind my nails. I was in the process of taking my nails off this morning when I was like, oh, I need to go pick up my order. Um, if you go and get your order from the actual store, uh, you get 10% off. And of course, you don't have to pay for the shipping or the handling. So, um, I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up. This may or may not be attached to another video. Um, I took video of, in pictures of the actual store itself. I'm not sure what will come out first or if it will be in the same video. Anyways, I will tell you guys that they had, I was supposed to get two boxes when I went and picked it up, and they goofed up and had um, the wrong name written on one of my boxes. So I'm missing polysorbate 20, a preservative, water soluble, 8 ounce clear oval plastic bottles, 12 of those, and shea butter ultra refined, 5 pounds of that. So I am missing that from my bet or from my box. They said that they saw it there and they didn't know what order it belonged to because it had the wrong last name written on it. So they're gonna ship it out to me. So that's good. Um, so they took care of that. So hopefully when I get that in, it'll be all good. Oh my gosh, there's like either a bee or a stink bug that just flew past my head. Oh, so creepy. Anyways, oh my gosh. Ugh. Gross. All right. So, I'm first going to show you guys my powders. And these were all on sale. I have orange powder, carrot powder, raspberry powder, pumpkin powder, lemon powder, and banana powder. These were all like 20% off or something, plus the 10% off in store. So I got those. I have four of these um, sodium hydroxide flakes. And then I have, I bought the last Silky Body Butter base. They're out of stock right now. And I also got the 50 pack of the craft boxes, which was really cool. And so I went, I did an online order, went to pick it up, and then I also bought stuff while I was there. And while I was there, I picked up these um, square boxes for salt soaps and loofah soaps. bottles I got a dozen of these caps but like I said the bottles will come in the mail later on what's wrong buddy what's wrong it's okay where's your bottle where's your sippy it's right there buddy it's right on the floor that's not your sippy sweetie oh, kids these days Patrick was so bad in the store it was so embarrassing I told the lady, I was like, you know, I'm the person that I judge in the store. I'm that person now. And it's so upsetting. But anyways. Palm oil, no stir. Eight pounds of that. And then I got... Coconut oil. Eight pounds of that. I figure, hey, might as well get bulk in those. That's bulk for me. And then I got a gallon. Sorry if I'm yelling into my phone. Seven pounds of olive oil refined A. I got some soap nuts and you could use these um, as a laundry detergent. I also got some shea butter wafers. I was supposed to get the, um, or cocoa butter wafers. I was supposed to get the shea butter in this order, but like I told you, that didn't work out. And then I also picked up some lavender power powder and a little high melt ultra refined shea butter to add to um, a solid lotion or deodorant. And then I have here. Hazelnut oil, 
macadamia nut oil, almond oil, and then I got a little Crafter's Choice green tea butter. And then I got some fragrances, which they put in this bag here. And then in this bag, they wrapped, do you see it? They wrapped them each individually in tissue paper. So let me get all these out. I have to look all of this stuff up to see, like, if it discolors, if it rices, all of that. I didn't check any of that. I just kind of smelled and took, or not took, bought. Smelled and I bought, not took. That would be stealing. Here's patchouli and hemp. This was a really nice earthy um, scent. Uh, it's like, um, a, it's a perfumey patchouli is what it smells like. Less dirty, more earthy. Earthy without being dirty like an incense would be. Almond and honey. This is like my favorite scent ever. Ugh. It's like a buttery smell. Like a buttery almond. Ugh. So good. Agave Nectar Odor Neutralize Neutralizer Fragrance Oil. And it just smells like, like almost like Febreze. Like the classic Febreze. Almond milk and sea salt. And this one smells really nutty. Like it's like really, um, you could smell like fruitiness to it, but it also has a lot of like um, that nut scent. Like it, you definitely smell the almond. And then pear blossom and amber fragrance oil. And this is just really good smelling. It has a really um, perfumey, it's a perfumey pear. So you could definitely smell like the amber in it. And the pear has that bit of a fruit to it. But it smells really, really clean, almost like um, Tresemme. It has a bit of that Tresemme smell to it, and I, I'm like, my nails are embarrassing right now. I, they match the Crafters Choice stuff though. Um, but there's my fragrances, and then I got this tall and skinny little 44 ounce um, mold. And I got this round cylinder style mold and some loofahs to make some loofah soaps. And that is it for my supplies that I got right now. Like I said, I'll be having some more supplies. Um, coming in the mail because they misplaced them and all that. So, um, I just wanted to thank you guys for watching and you may or may not get the handmade studio tour, um, before this or after this, who knows. And let me just show you guys the bag that they gave me and they put all my stuff in, well, there's already dog hair on it. It's like this went near my house and got dog hair on it. It says, Handmade Studios Learn, Create, and Share. So, whoops. That's it, guys. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in my next video. All right, bye.